Hey everyone, Morgan here from Simple Networks, and today we're going to be taking a look at three small business networks that you can set up with Unify. Now the purpose of this video is to provide some baselines or some jumping off points for you. These are by no means set in stone, and obviously you can customize them to your liking, but this should help provide you with some baselines to get started. All right, so here are the three networks that I have come up with, each for varying amounts of employees. I went up to 10 employees, up to 30 employees, and up to 50. Now, obviously, small businesses can have, I think it's up to 500 employees, according to the Small Business Association. But once you start to get past that 100 employees, or really 50 employees, I start to move it into more of a medium-sized business, and I would take a different approach. So we're going to stick to the smaller businesses here. So for network one, we're going up to 10 employees. This network will be will work great for you, up to 10 people. Now, obviously, it varies depending on usage. This is just a generalization. But this is going to be ideal for your startups, your mom and pop shops, and your small retail shops. So when I say startups, maybe you're working out of your garage, or maybe you got a tiny little single room office that you're running out or something like that, and you really just need a network to get started, and you don't have a lot of money to spend, this is going to be the cheapest network, the easiest to set up, um, and it does leave a little bit of room for flexibility. Not a whole lot, but it does have a little bit in there. So I went with the assumption that if you're using this network, you're probably not going to have any IP phones or integrated network cameras, right? So you're probably using a landline or employees are using cell phones. And if you do have a camera system, it's probably something like Simply Safe that runs off the Wi-Fi. And there's nothing wrong with any of this. Um, I'm just saying that that's likely where it's going to be. You know, if you go to like a retail shop on the boardwalk, right? Usually you'll see that they just have a landline um, and they don't have security cameras all over the place because frankly, it's a very small amount of space. And if you're a mom and pop or a startup, you don't have a ton of extra money to spend, so you're probably using Simply Safe and a landline or a cell phone. So network number two is going to be up to 30 employees. This is if you're growing a little bit. Maybe you've grown out of network number one, or maybe you just already have an existing business that needs a little more oomph than that. This is actually a pretty big step up because you're going from up to 10 employees for handling up to 30 employees or 30 people, users, really, really well. Um, and this is going to allow you to add some network cameras as well as some voice over IP phones and not run into any throughput issues, right? So this would be more ideal for coffee shops, uh, small restaurants, and small office locations. Coffee shops and small restaurants, everyone's always connecting to Wi-Fi, right? <laughs> coffee shop is, is basically Wi-Fi shop that serves coffee at this point, right? Everyone expects um, a Wi-Fi connection there. Same with smaller restaurants. And then the final step up to network three is up to 50 employees, even more IP phones, a whole bunch of cameras. And I think this would be more ideal for your medium sized retail shops, like in a strip mall type of thing, car dealerships where you're going to have a lot of cameras and a lot of desks that all need their own phone and workstation and stuff like that. And your larger small business office locations. Um, and obviously, we're about to go through these, but obviously remember that you can mix and match here, right? These are just baselines. You can totally mix network one and network two here and get good results. So let's move on to the first network. Network number one, again, really simple, probably great for up to 10 employees. You're not worried about cameras or phones. So we're going to do the Unify Secured Gateway here, which is a really, really great device. It does get a lot of crap. But for the price, $139, I think it works pretty well, especially for small businesses. Um, connected to that, we're going to have the Switch Lite 8 PoE. This is actually a really, really great switch. It's only got eight ports, but four of those are PoE enabled. I believe it's PoE+. PoE Plus. And that's going to allow us to run our Cloud Key Gen 2, which is going to be our network controller. So we won't have to plug that in separately with USB. And it's also going to power our AP Wi-Fi 6 Lite access point. So there you go. Pretty simple. We only have four unified devices here, but we have a full-blown network setup. This is going to be great because it actually does leave you with two open PoE ports if you wanted to add some cameras or something down the line, or maybe you end up needing another access point. Uh, and then it's also going to leave you four non-PoE ports here for workstations. Maybe you have one or two workstations or some point of sales equipment like a cash register or two or something like that, um, you're going to be good to go. And it leaves a little extra room for some upgrades in the future. All of this equipment that you see here, not including the iMac obviously, 
is 526 bucks. Really not too bad. So let's move on to the next network and we're gonna step it up in equipment and price here, as you're gonna see. All right, so here's network number two. This is your up to 30 employees network. Again, that's a generalization. Um, but, but this network's gonna offer you a bit more flexibility when it comes to voice over IP phones and security cameras. So as you can see, we're still using the Unify Security Gateway, still a great device for this application, but we've upgraded our switch to the Switch 24 PoE, which gives you, I believe, 16 PoE Plus ports, which is going to give you everything you need for some cameras and more access points and stuff like that. We've also upgraded the Cloud Key from the Cloud Key Gen 2 to the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus. It's only a few more bucks. It's actually less than $100 more. But what's great about this device is it has Unify Protect built in. So you can actually run up to 20 cameras on the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus. Now, I wouldn't necessarily recommend that because I think if you actually tried to have the Gen 2 Plus manage 20 cameras and your network, it would probably melt. So I'm going to say maximum 10 there. Um, but in this uh, list of equipment, I've included three of the bullet cameras, the uh, G3 bullet cameras. Uh, they do come in a bundle. That's why I have that asterisk there. You get a better deal. So I went with the three pack of those. And those can all be powered off the Switch's uh, PoE slots. And we also did three access points. Uh, Unify's access points perform very, very well in my experience. So if you've got a coffee shop, small business, or like a small office location for your business, or a small restaurant, uh, three of these access points should do pretty well for you. You probably wouldn't even need all three. You could probably get away with one or two, depending on, again, the size of your location coffee shop, you might want a few more to uh, kind of even the load a bit. But all of this equipment, your USG, your Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus, your cameras, your bullet cameras, and your access points and your new switch, that's going to run you $14.53. It's actually really not a bad price. It is a big jump up if we go back from the $5.26. Um, but a lot of value for your money there. And that's something that I find with Unify a lot. All right, so the third and final network. The third and final network is for your up to 50 employees. Maybe you've got a lot more cameras or a lot more IP phones. Maybe you're just a bigger location, medium-sized retail, like in a strip mall or something like that. A car dealership where you've got a phone at every desk, a workstation at every desk, and you got cameras inside and out because they don't want you stealing their cars, right? or larger small business office locations. And I know that sounds like an oxymoron, but I think you get what I mean. If you're a small business that has a uh, decently sized office location, maybe with a warehouse or something like that, this is the territory you're gonna wanna be in. So we finally swapped out the USG. We're going with the Dream Machine Pro, and this device really is a beast. It is your Unify Network, Unify Protect, Unify Voice over IP if you wanted it all in one unit, and it's even got um, an eight port switch there for you. And it's got a pretty powerful quad core processor, which is gonna be able to handle all the stuff we're gonna throw at it way better than the USG. All right, so let's go through it. So from the Dream Machine Pro, um, oh, and I forgot to mention this also, it replaces the cloud key, yeah. So you don't need a cloud key anymore, all handled by this device, which is why it's called the Dream Machine. So from there, we're going in big time to the Switch 48 PoE, 48 Ethernet ports, which is going to be great for all your access points, all your voice over IP phones, all your cameras, and all your workstations with probably room to spare. It would be, it would be pretty hard in a smaller business to fill this switch up unless you had a lot of servers or something like that. Um, but for access points, I've given us three of the AP Wi-Fi 6 lights. Um, that I carried that over from the last one, but they're really good devices. So maybe this is out in your showroom or something like that at your car dealership, or maybe it's covering the guest lobby at your office location and something like that. But then maybe you got some areas where you need some stronger coverage, right? Maybe out in your warehouse or at the corporate level, <laughs> floor two, if you know what I mean, or something like that. Um, I've thrown a few of the, you know, long range ones in there, the AP Wi-Fi 6 long range devices that are going to get you better coverage, a little bit better throughput, maybe some better consistency with connection speeds. And maybe, I know car dealers around me, I was really thinking car dealer for this one, 
Um, but car dealers around me will often have uh, pretty big lots. So I threw in an outdoor extender here. It is the Access Point Mesh. Really cheap, 99 bucks, and you can extend some coverage out into your parking lot or your rec area or something like that. Still got some uh, G3 bullet cameras in there, three of those, but I also added in some, three of the G4 dome cameras. You know, those more traditional cameras for up on the ceiling, uh, instead of having them like kind of angle out of the wall, you can actually have them in your center, your room, or what have you. So all this combined, your dream machine, your new switch, your access points, your cameras, gonna run you about $26.98. And what's fantastic about this network, I mean, $26.98 for um, a network for a business that's, you know, housing up to 50 employees, really, that's really isn't bad. And this will handle the load pretty good. But what's great about this is you have a lot of expandability. So your switch here has SFP ports so that you can, you know, throw another switch into the mix if you want a load balance or maybe you've got just a lot of devices, a lot of drops that need connecting. Your um, Dream Machine Pro here actually has uh, an 8-port switch built into it um, and some SFP Plus ports. So you could, you could grab another one of these 48 POEs and run it off there, and you could go pretty far with this. Um, but these, again, these are just starting points. All right, so hopefully this was helpful to you in some way. If you have suggestions or comments or questions, leave them down in the comments section below. Subscribe for more videos like this. We go uh, these basic videos, but I also do like to go a little more in depth sometimes so you can look forward to that. Other than that, subscribe if you want to, don't if you don't, and have a great rest of your day.